Sure. Since China uh, launched Yang Li Wei, their first national astronaut in 2003, each mission has been successively more uh, demanding and sh demonstrating more capability. They launched multiple crews, you know, crews with multiple astronauts on board. They uh, they've done their did their first spacewalk in 2008 with Zai Zigang. And then, um, of course, their Tiangong-1, Tiangong-2, the small space labs that they uh, launched into orbit, flew several crews to those small space labs of you know, maximum duration of around 30 days. And, uh, and now, of course, with the launch of their core module of their space station, and now the first long duration crew that's gonna stay up there for three months, uh, that's a pretty big step forward. And that crew recently performed um, an actual working spacewalk, if you will. The Zai Zikan's demonstration spacewalk was only about 15, 20 minutes long. This one was full duration, probably around six hours to actually you know, do some work, place some tools outside, things like that. So they're demonstrating further uh, capabilities as they go along in their program. Looking down the road, of course, uh, with human space flight, they've openly said that they want to land their own astronauts on the moon sometime in the 2030s. And of course, they've already landed rovers on the moon, including one on the far side, first of a, any country to do that uh, just a few years ago. And most recently, they've uh, landed their first Mars rover successfully. So that uh, vehicle is currently exploring Mars for the Chinese space program.